Hello and welcome again. So, in continuation with the last lecture, in which I taught you about acute appendicitis, which is the acute inflammation of appendix, I will uh, tell you how to draw the microscopic diagram of uh, appendicitis step by step. So, for that, you need to know few basic points. First, the uh, normal histology of appendix, because at the end we just have to uh, uh, show the neutrophilic infiltration of all the layers of appendix. So, for that you need to know the normal histology of appendix. So, that the appendix has, has got four layers. First is the mucosa. Mucosa is composed of the mucosal lining epithelium. Epithelium is tall columnar and in that it has got interspersed goblet cells. So, you have, just have to make the tall columnar epithelium with the nuclei which is perpendicular to the basement membrane. So, this is the mucosal lining epithelium. After that we make the connective tissue in the lamina propria. So, connective tissue it is made up of the fibroblast and the blood vessels. Fibroblast they are spindle shaped and having the pointed edges and they have an elongated nucleus. Then you make the blood vessels with RBCs inside it. So, that will, will show in the lamina propria. Lamina propria also shows these mucosal glands which are formed when this epithelium dips down into the lamina propria. Next, there is the layer of muscularis mucosae. This is a thin layer of the smooth muscle cells. And after that, there is the submucosa. In the submucosa, there in the impedix, there are lymphoid follicles. So, these are the lymphoid follicles composed of the lymphoid cells the, in the various stages. And this generally, they get hyperplastic in appendicitis. Next layer is the muscularis propria. I told you in the last lecture that neutrophilic infiltration of the muscularis layer. It is most pathognomic for acute appendicitis. So, we have to draw uh, neutrophils in this. And last layer is serosa. It again composed of fibrovascular connective tissue and here uh, we will also show the congested blood vessels. So, what you need to know for drawing the diagram of appendicitis. First is the epithelium, how it, you will make the epithelium. Second, the lymphoid follicle. In the form of circle, you make the lymphocytes, the lymphoid cells. Thirdly, <coughs> connected tissue which you will make in the lamina propria, submucosa as well as serosa. Then smooth muscles. So, in the smooth muscle cells, they are spindle shaped and they are basically cigar shaped and their nucleus is also having the rounded ends. So, this is smooth muscle which we will make in the muscularis propria. Lastly, the neutrophil. So, for the neutrophil, you make the lobe nucleus like this. You can make any three lobes, four lobes, whatever you like and, and after that you make a small circle, circle around it. So, this is how the neutrophil looks like. So, uh, after knowing all these basics, let us move to drawing the diagram of <coughs> acute appendicitis. So, let us start. <coughs> so, first you make the mucosal lining epithelium. You can make it ulcerated, so you just show the lack of lining in between. Now you make the nuclei. Then you give it a background color for whole of the diagram. Next, we make the glands in the lamina propria. So again, glands will be lined by the tall columnar epithelium. Like this. Then again, you make the nucleus. Then this is muscularis mucosae which will separate the mucosa from the submucosa. Then you make the connective tissue, the congested blood vessels with RBCs inside them. In the submucosa, we make the hyperplastic lymphoid follicles. Then again, the connective tissue. And, uh, the next layer is muscularis propria. So, muscle layer, uh, this will have the transverse and longitudinal muscle fibers. These are the transverse fibers. Uh, you make the spindle shaped cells with a cigar shaped nucleus and the cells which are longitudinal in cut section they will just be seen as rounded. Last layer is serosa. So in serosa again you make the connective tissue and congested blood vessels. After that what we make we do we draw the infiltration by the neutrophils. So you just make the neutrophils in all the layers especially in the muscularis propria. So, you make the uh, nucleus which is lobed. So, that is how we recognize the neutrophils in the histopathology. Now, last, last thing is the labeling. So, you label 
the mucosa sub mucosa all the layers then the lymphoid follicles then neutrophils so first we draw the mucosal epithelium then ulcerated mucosa the mena propria lymphoid follicles then muscle layer serosa most importantly neutrophils in the muscle layer then you can also show neutrophils in other layers so you can just label the neutrophils everywhere because it is in transmural inflammation all the layers they show inflammation by the neutrophils so i hope this uh, step by step depiction of uh, diagram of ap acute appendicitis is helpful to you and any questions they are most welcome in the comment section and your feedback is also most welcome and thank you very much